Ford Escape 2013 through 2019 six speed automatic transmission. Customer's concern when going into drive and going to accelerate, there's poor acceleration. Okay, just did it there. See that? Just bucking and jerking and not moving. Pedal to the floor right now. There is no pump whine. And at first when I started the engine and put it in drive, it would not move at all. One more time here. Did you hear that? Just jerked really hard. Look at that. All the way to the floor. Okay, I'm gonna get to the point here. It's a common issue. You may hear a pump whine with it. If you hear a whining noise in the transmission, then your pump's failing. But in this particular situation, there's very poor engagement in, in a drive, but not in reverse. Reverse is fine with a no pump whine. And what this is, is the forward clutch piston is leaking and it caused the forward clutch snap ring to rotate for the clutch pack. And when that happens, it breaks the transmission case on the inside, puts a chunk of metal out. Ooh, it's, did you hear that? <laughs> uh, takes a chunk of metal out of the transmission case on the inside. Usually it's not ca as catastrophic as it sounds. It just knocks a chunk of metal off and it just kind of sits there floating in the fluid. But uh, the transmission needs to be tore down and have this. I'm probably going to go ahead and replace the whole center support with the new front support. Uh, excuse me, the new forward piston and uh, low reverse piston on the center support, new Ford clutch and snap ring and transmission case. While I'm in there, I'm going to address common issues, of course, because this is an, a big job. And uh, I'm going to replace the torque converter in the front pump and the valve body and the solenoid body, which is uh, sold separate from the valve body, but it's they both go together. But um, that'll take care of their concern. I'm going to take it all the way apart and clean it, make sure everything looks all right. But uh, Essentially, this is just a transmission overhaul. You can also replace the transmission. An overhaul is going to be $4,000 maybe, uh, either at the dealer or a side shop. A uh, replacement is going to be, for a two-wheel drive, probably $6,000. And an all-wheel drive, about $7,000. So you can either get it fixed or sell it as is. Sorry, sorry about your luck, but it's a somewhat common issue there. Not as common as the pump whine and the pump failure on these 6F35s, but uh, it's definitely something that happens, and uh, you're not alone. That about covers everything I uh, wanted to talk about, okay? So if you have any questions, let me know in the comments below, and I'm, I usually answer them really quickly. I also have a Facebook and Discord group, and I also have other videos on this transmission, including a teardown video and a removal video. So i um, just trying to help you guys out there, so... Yeah, let me know if uh, you need any help. If you can't find the videos, I'll link them for you. All right, have a great day.